Hello and welcome. Absolutely ideal weather for football here in Manchester at the Etihad. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. And it's all about action from the Premier League in this case. It is Manchester City up against Aston Villa. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Watkins won it back. And here's the Manchester City lineup. Ederson stands between the posts. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Corner for Manchester City. Corner kick played in. It comes to nothing in the end. De Bruyne. Grealish. Holland. Gabriel Jesus. Oh, it might be. And diving to thwart him. They favoured a short one here. That's someone to play it to. Can they take the lead here? In it goes! An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, that was a fairly easy finish in the end, but he still had to take it. He won't mind how they come, though. And so the game back in business, City ahead here. Yes. Bernardo Silva. Silva. On to Holland. Good tackle. Now showing excellent vision. again and with that the attack fizzles out Silva excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward mastery of the passing game Joao Cancelo on to Holland De Bruyne and it might be it's in, they're looking really relaxed and confident and not giving the opposition much of a look in. Well, let's look at the replay. They move the ball so well, just waiting for an opening and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Second goal for them here.
Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball. And as a result, have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch. And I don't think anything's going to change that. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Holland. He continues his run. And it's Gabriel Jesus. Rodri. Bernardo Silva. Just knocking it around, looking to carve out a chance. Holland. Could be. And tipping it over the crossbar. And that's a corner. Let's see about the delivery. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. Rodri, crossing opportunity. De Bruyne. And now Rodri. And a long way out here. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Superb block. The verdict is offside here. Rodri Holland well sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game and with that the first half draws to a close well we're highlighting him for a reason Stuart he's putting in a really authoritative performance here well he's been a joy to watch so far he's got so much ability and it was also a very good finish for his goal he's been excellent So back in business with City very much the dominant side. Can they repeat that in the second 45? Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Maximum commitment and he's given away the corner. Who can they pick out? Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Holland. And a good take under duress there. Look at Dinia. Ollie Watkins. Keeping the ball moving. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Holland. Read it well. Well, that ball looks promising. 
Grealish. Rodri. And borderline offside, but correct. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number 10, Jack Grealish, coming onto the pitch. Number 7, Raheem Sterling. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Chance to do damage. De Bruyne. Well, he didn't miss by all that much. Well, he struck it quite nicely, but the keeper was always in control of the situation. He knew that was going wide. Substitution for Aston Villa. Coming they will the now make use of the substitutes bench. Coming onto the pitch, number 20, Danny Ings. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Silva. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Oh, big chance. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. John McGinn. The of Douglas Luiz. Douglas Luiz. It's with Douglas Luiz. Effective challenge. Sterling. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. Laporte. So getting close to the end of this one, and City pushing all the right buttons. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Well read to win possession back. Just 10 minutes remaining here. Rodri. On to Holland. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Well, they're keeping their opponents moving and guessing. And Bernardo Silva has it. Well, he couldn't quite hit the target, Stuart. Well, it's a decent effort, but I don't think it was ever going to trouble the goalkeeper. A change in the offing for City. Holland. De Bruyne. Now Gundogan, a goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them.
Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. This is turning into something of a rout, 4-0. And the referee has deemed that an additional four... You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, just look at this again. Great technique, perfect contact, and a brilliant finish. Top stuff. Goals in plentiful supply. 4-1 currently. And there goes the final whistle. A real sense of feel-good for City fans everywhere. They take the three points from this game. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? Particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively and almost cutting through at will at times. The result never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Well, many will regard him as the complete midfield player, Kevin De Bruyne. And how do you shackle him? It's well nigh impossible, Stuart. Yeah, he'll be happy coming off the pitch. He worked hard, he was always involved in the game, and he scored a very good goal. That was an impressive performance today.